All right, welcome everyone. There's more dungeon crawl stone suit. We're back with some more uh, draconian monk being a big uh, Aquar uh, boy with a bunch of sweet weapons. Pretty much, it's really good. I don't know. Uh, I was thinking of going with uh, some kind of like with with more pole arms. I actually, in, I think that I can go for the body this game. So I'm gonna go go ahead and do that. Uh, I'm gonna train a bit of charms. Regen is pretty much the one spell I kind of wanted. So I was like, okay, I'll take that. Oh, cool. This is really happening in real life. Sure. That's okay. Well, big rip for us. Let's just go down this staircase and hopefully things will be okay. Oh, they're all here. Okay, that's three upstairs. I didn't even notice that last time. Cool. I guess I'll just... Uh, I can't go up there. That's not the floor. How did I get here then? All these questions and more will be answered in today's video, apparently. Where the hell- wait, what? Did I get dispersed off my thing? Is that what happened? What? How did I come down? What? Where am I? Who is this? Hello? Where am I? I'm lost. Alright, we're lagging today. That's that's a good sign. Usually when I lag, I do really well. I, I don't get annoyed, you know. I definitely perform you know, excellently, whenever I, whenever I'm in this position. Oh boy, okay. Okay, we're in, we're in, we're in Lagsville. I'm not gonna lie, guys, we're in a bit of Lagsville right now. It's, it's a little hard to play. I'm trying my best, I'm doing my best. Okay, it's not lagging anymore. Kind of? Maybe? No, nope, it's still lagging. Never mind, that's fine. Alright, um, cool, I guess. So today is, uh, Tuesday. And Tuesday is... I'm just I'm just saying this for like future videos and stuff, but on average I would say that the two peak days of my tiredness would either be like Tuesday night or Thursday night because I'm intending to skip some lectures from now on. Um, just because like there's no real choice, sort of. Like it's very hard for someone to make uh, every single lecture that uh, they've been assigned. So anything that's not like asking for attendance, I'm pretty much gonna just sit at home and do the lecture recordings. It's easier, it's nicer. Uh, I personally hate lecture recordings. I don't know how you guys feel about that. I mean, some of you guys either haven't done it before or will never do it, because uh, you've already passed the age where you know university is a real thing. But you know, it's it's a problem for me, so that's why I'm talking about it. I don't know. I guess I shouldn't really talk about it. But again, like this character is pretty strong, uh, and I'm lagging, so I'm trying to like fill time without trying to rip my head off. Um, speaking of ripping heads off, this Hydra. Get it? Because uh, his heads get ripped off. Yeah, um, I'm pretty funny. Uh, you can tell I'm funny because I said I was funny. That was, that was, that was, that's how you know. So if, if I didn't say that, I bet you guys wouldn't understand that I was funny. Holy shit, this lag is so bad. Yuck. Did I move? Nope. Okay, now I moved. Okay, cool. You know, this is what it was like playing on uh, crawl.acrazyact.org. That was that was truly hell. Truly, true suffering was this. This is exactly what it looked like, except way slower. Like this is actually pretty fast still. Ah, come on, please let me in. I just want to play video games. Dungeon Crawl Stun Soup, the video game. You know, you know the one. Ah, uh, please. Okay, cool. We got there. All right, let's go to Orc. Alright, cool, 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 cool. Kill that guy. And continue on. You know, it's already 10th. Oh, fuck. Wait a minute. Hold on a second. Uh, okay, Jogron's here. Let me try to kill him real quick. If he got too antsy, I would have tried to move into the dispersal trap. Just to create some space. But thankfully, I just killed him in one hit. This is the slowest thing ever. I hate this. Oh, man. Uh, look at this. Look at this is so bad. This is actually the worst. Okay. Hey, this Fenar, I guess Let me heroism finesse this guy real quick Throw some lightning out, you know the usual kill this or priestess first or priest Because he's summoned all kinds of nasty dudes Okay, I lost a bit of piety there, so I can't I don't think I can finesse anymore. That's okay though I don't need to tab and dab that much. I can just tab. It's fine. I didn't get a mutation, that was nice. That was very nice of the game to not mutate me to hell. Alright, cool. I'm just hoping that I don't accidentally die to some laggy bullshit. 
Um, cause that, that would be, that would be quite sad. Cause like, it's not really my fault. Well, it kind of is. I guess I'm playing too fast, but... Come on. What's life if you can't play a little bit fast? You know what I mean? Why, live life on the edge. Go, uh, oh, manual of fighting. That's a nice one. I really like that. I'm gonna go ahead and pick that up. I have no money left, but I have fighting now, so it's fine. Who cares? Fighting is love. Fighting is, oh, that's a lot of guys. Okay. Let me just walk away real quick, as laggily as I can. Is this what it feels like to be a slow player? Damn. It feels bad, man. Oh, come on. Yeah. I had to make sure that I didn't, like, overpress keys, because if I did that, I would have been... I, I love how someone met someone waits until I fucking record, and then they message me. One, one second, guys. Shut the fuck up. Don't fucking fuck off. Oh my god, fuck. Sorry, okay, I'm back. Okay. My apologies. Like, I'm like, wait an hour before you talk to me. So then I start recording. He's like, what do you mean? What do you mean one hour? I don't understand this concept. It's like... Oh. It's okay, though. It's okay, you didn't have to see it. You didn't have to see this tomfoolery. This tomfuckery that is going on. That's like the new term that should be happening. Tom fuckery. I don't know why. I'm just I'm just making shit up. I don't know. Come on, let me in. Ah, everything hurts so much. Ah, oh, I probably shouldn't have gone down that staircase. I did it though. So who cares? It's fine. It's all good. Let me go back up this staircase. I got marked, because, you know, enemy step in traps now. Yay. What a fun and exciting mechanic in this video game. I love it when I have no control over what the- Did you seriously message me again? You motherfucker! Holy shit. I'm gonna chew him out. 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 Just for you guys. Dude. I literally said I'm recording. Alright, there we go. I chewed him out really hard, and then I forgot to un unmute my thing. Nice. See? You could argue that I should have just logged out of League of Legends, but... Unfortunately for me now, my League my league client is literally like a business email, so... Rip me, I guess. I don't know. Everyone's like adding me every 10 seconds. I, is this what it feels like to be popular? Yeet. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> Uh, I, I don't know how I started doing it, but like, I, I don't know when I started doing it, but like, I now yeet unironically. I have to. It's part of- Oh, bits are running nice. I got my Nikes. Yeah, in the tournament videos, I, I kept like, asking everyone if they said Nikes or Nikes. And, let's be real, if you say Nikes, you're a degenerate, and you shouldn't be allowed to fucking wear Nikes. Like, come on. Don't do that. Don't call them Nikes. It's rude. It's like, it goes against the, the political culture. Oh, em embroidered hat. Why, thank you. Any other gifts that you've given me that I've completely ignored? No, just the hat. Okay, fair enough. Thank you very much. I appreciate that, Akawaru. And now, I will go to the spider's nest. Even though, that's probably gonna kill me. Because I have no way of really defending myself against enemies that come and beat me up really fast, like this. Okay. So, you can see here that... This is gonna get rough. This is gonna get real rough. And this is gonna get quite nasty. So, you know. Avert your eyes if you're weak of heart. Because this is gonna fucking suck for me. Ugh. Okay. Well, we'll just do it. We'll just make sure we're regening up. You know. Doing the good stuff. I got regen at 4%. That's pretty nice, actually. I'm gonna go ahead and turn that stuff off. Train for more pole arms, I guess. I mean, at some point, the Bardish is probably gonna be better than this freezing... This awesome, like... Halberd, but it's kind of hard to know when that's the case because a body of vampiricism isn't exactly like the most incredible damage wise weapon. This is a very high damage weapon. The base damage is uh, 13, but that's only 5 less than the Halberd. But the Halberd is like not using a damage brand. This is a pretty decent brand, freezing. Um, so, like I said, it's kind of hard to judge when I'm doing more damage and on top of that it's also um, quite hard to judge when uh, 
it's sort of hard to judge when the utility of vampiricness kind of outweighs all the other stuff that I have from this weapon. Like, I have RN Triple Plus, RLX, you know, those are good stuff. I already have RLX, but, you know, R Poise, RN Triple Plus, like, those are somewhat decent, at least, as tools. And, um, you know, it, it's just kind of hard to see if... I'm, I'm trying to figure out, I guess, trying to suss it out when I should be doing it. Um, like, making the switch. I mean, I guess, theoretically, I could switch it, uh, when my pawns gets to level 21, and then every time I need to be at Mindalay, I can use Heroism. I mean, that is technically the real way you're supposed to play Aquar, but I'm kind of lazy. I don't know. I guess I'll wait. Yeah, I can wait. That's fine. Alright. Like, okay, so, effectively, I, looking at this character right now, in a 1v1, there's nothing that can really kill me. It's mostly when I get surrounded. Uh, that's gonna be the primary, like, time that I'm scared. But otherwise, like, even without heroism, you can see me just smashing a Emperor Scorpion. That kind of is, like, really good. But the problem with the, with that kind of strength, that I can just fight any 1v1 uh, enemy, uh, never mind, I, I can't fight a, one of these corrosive guys, that's, that's too much, apparently. Rip me. Ouch. Come on, please let me live. Please let me go. Please stop fighting me. Okay, Tarantel, you've breathed your last, mate. Well, actually, I think Tarantel has breathed through the skeleton, so, you know, maybe he didn't breathe his last, but he, bro he, bre he breathed, like, one of his last many breaths. I don't know. I don't know. What whatever it, it was meant to be. You know, you, you know what I was trying to say, right? I, I know, I assume everyone knows what I was going for there. But yeah, let me try to 1v1 that Entropy Weaver again. One more time. Okay, that's not a 1v1. I asked specifically for 1v1. I was not granted my 1v1. I'm calling the police. This is rude. Okay, like, anytime you want to enslave, you know, just, you know, just do your job. It's fine. Be happy to, you know... You know what, fuck this. I'm just gonna heroism finesse. I'm just gonna tab and dab. You know what I mean? Like, sometimes... You know, modern modern problems need modern solutions, and this is my solution. It's it's tab and then dab, because if you do that, like, who's gonna stop you? Who can who can who in this in this good world can stop you from tabbing and dabbing? No one, no one is the answer to that question. Ow, that's a lot of poison damage. Ouch. Except the police, they they might be able to stop you, but you know, you can still probably do it until uh oh something's hitting me. Oh, it's one of those ghost moth guys. Okay, remember when I said I can 1v1 anything in the game? I, that was a lie. That was I have determined that to be uh, a mistruth, a, 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 a misleading thing to say. I should not have said it. I apologize. My bad. I will never do it again. <sighs> this character is actually bad. Okay, fair enough. Fair enough. Understandable. I mean, what, what else should I train for? That's the problem. Like, I could train for anime dead. Actually, I can already use Animate Dead. I don't know why I'm not using it. In fact, that's broken. Why the hell am I not using it? That makes no sense. Okay, well, now I have Animate Dead. That should make this place a lot easier. Uh, anything else I can get real quick? Uh, Gel's Gravitas, no. Takima's Dance, no. Nothing really, I guess. They're mostly like Conjuration stuff, I suppose. I could look for Vile Clutch, maybe. No, uh, Spectral Weapon? No, that's halberd. Where did spec come from? What the fuck? Huh? Okay, well that was a bit. I feel like Giant Slayer is a pretty common artifact name. Maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. Anyway, let me kill these guys real quick. Then animate dead. And then just continue to kill. This is not dangerous at all. This is fully calculated. This is 100% calculated. At no point there was I in any danger, guys. It was just... It was just a trick, you know what I mean? It was just one of those wow factor things where, you know, I do something unnecessarily dangerous to attract attention. That's how it is sometimes in the industry. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh, also, oh my god, really? Okay, no, we got this. Okay, we're fine, we're fine. Just go back. Oh, one thing, one thing that really pisses me off right now is that, uh, <laughs> I have, I have the Poor, unfortunate luck of having a... Oh, Mind Magic, never mind. I am very lucky. Oh, man. That's really good. Uh, let me turn some translocations real quick. Yeah, I have the... Unf wow, I have Arlek. That was real life right there. 
That happened to me just then. You saw that, right? Everyone saw that that spark boss come in like 85 like miles an hour or 100 kilometers an hour, whatever you want to call it, and just instantly whoop me. That was real. That happened. Oh man. And the problem is I can't use my lightning breath because these stupid anime dead guys are in the way. Not that that's bad necessarily, it's just annoying. There we go. Okay. Anyway, what was I saying? Yeah, so I have the unfort really, I'm I'm really still losing to this guy. I killed one without heroism, now I can't kill one with heroism. I don't understand how this game works. Did heroism make me weaker somehow? Is that how that works? Did I misunderstand something in the terms of service or something? Okay, there we go. Oh, please don't. Please don't. Oh, man. I have time for this shit, man. Come on. Fuck off. There we go. Jeez. Another one, of course. Come on, die. Ah. Oh. Let me go, guys. Let me go. Um. I'm trying to tell this fucking story here, damn it. And here you guys are just distracting me. Fuck's sake. Let me drop these 1,000 stones I just had in my back pocket. Sure. Uh. Yeah, so I have I have an older edition of a book, and if you ever have tried to use a reading guide with the older edition of a book, like, just good luck, man. Because what I'm doing here is, like, I have to read a case law, for example, right? And then suddenly, it'll just be like, oh, turn to 6.3. And I'm like, okay, I'll turn to 6.3, sure. Gullible, foolish me, thinking that the book would be able to reference its own self without fucking up. Nope, 6.3 doesn't exist in the book. Like, I'm actually getting trolled. I don't know what the fuck's going on. I'm, I'm, I'm really upset by this. Sorry. So, like, yeah. That's, that's been my life the last couple of hours, trying to figure out where the fuck these cases are. I eventually just said, fuck this, I'm going online. And then I just did it all online. Uh, probably not the way they wanted me to do it, but it's the way I'm doing it. Because, you know, I ain't got time for this shit, man. I ain't got time at all. I'm, I'm busy. I got stuff to do. I got games to play. You know what I mean? Like this one. This is a video game that I'm playing right now. You're you're watching it play. I'm recording this in real life. You, like it sounds crazy. It's true though. It's the truth. Oh goodness, that's bad. Can I paralyze you? Thank you. Ah, this sucks. This really sucks. Okay, that's that's much better. Okay, so it looks like with. Uh, See, Invis, I'm in much better shape than I was before. Wow, that was a lot of damage. Damn. Also, I like how because I started casting spells, I'm now starving at every opportunity. That's that's pretty funny to me. I find that humorous. And by humorous, I mean really sad, and I, I'm really quite depressed about it. Please let me go. Please let me stop starving. I just want to stop starving. Like, why is it that one melee character should starve like this so many times? Oh, cool. Okay. Fine. Sure. Whatever. I'll take it. I'll, I'll say that much. I'll take that one on the chin. You know what I mean? I don't know what that exactly means. I don't know what who offers their chin to be attacked. That makes no real sense. That saying actually makes no sense at all. I'm going to revoke that status. I'm not going to say that. I'm not taking it on the chin because I don't know what that means. And that sounds ridiculous. I'm not doing it. I refuse. I'll clock it on the head. There we go. That sounds good, right? Speaking of clocks, <laughs> another nerd, th another nerd thing that I do. So if, you, if you've if you've been a long time viewer of the channel, uh, oh, this is a big rune vault. I probably should like talk about this, but I don't know. It's not that hard. As long as I take this, basically the the trick to these rune vaults, these spider ones, is just take it really slow. If I just like X out this area, for example, and I walk around and just clear the rest of the floor. And hopefully things at some point, you know, come fight me. I'll be fine. Oh, cool. Whatever. Um, yeah, I actually started syncing my watch to, um, to, like, the website. Like, the UTC website. I think that's a good idea because having a standardized time helps me figure out if I'm actually plus or minus uh, per day. Looks like I'm plus or minus a couple of seconds, but I'll have to check again. Just to see, like, how much time I'm losing or gaining on a watch. It's a really nerdy thing to do, I don't know. But, I think it's kind of interesting. Uh, I actually I actually read about uh, Atomic Time, which is even more interesting because it talks about like, I think it's like, what, the number of times a certain atom um, 
vibrates like like how a, a one second is like based on something I don't know god damn it I'm really bad at it. just look up atomic time you'll know you'll, it'll explain it to you but it was pretty interesting I don't know um oh gosh there's a lot of stuff here isn't there okay I'll just back off here just chill out with regen see one common misconception with Aquaru is that you can't be a summoner that's not true at all. You can be a summoner, just don't attack your, your summons, and then you'll be fine. But, uh, I have a very bad habit of just, like, straight up attacking my my summons. For no real reason, other than, like, you know, I can't lull. Not really, it's just like, I don't know. I just inadvertently die. I don't, I don't, I don't really have control over that situation. Okay, switch to this. Maybe get heroism, just so it's an easy fight. Go back to... I don't know why I keep heroism in. Fuck. Oh, it's because I think I'm your red for some reason. I'm not used to having a character that can attack and also use animate dead. So I'm like pretending I'm your red and pressing AA instead of ZQ to cast uh, <laughs> to cast animate dead. I think it's because I played a your red character in the tournament at some point. By the way, your red is really good. He's totally, totally like underrated as like an invocation space god, not even as like a real god. Um, I don't know what I was playing actually. I forgot. But, all I remember is, like, I basically didn't use my my undead at all. I just sort of ignored that, and then just drained life every every second of the day. Okay, let's Heroism Finesse here, just because I'm kind of lazy. Honestly, I shouldn't do that. I should just, like, walk back, because, you know, stuff like this happens where I'm Heroism and Finesse, and he still manages to do 100 damage to me. But, you know, we'll pretend that that was real life, and that wasn't... <sighs> and then here he is, ignoring all my shots of acid, and then he misses another 14 attacks, and now I'm almost about to die. Uh, this is a fun game. And then he dies to just literally nothing. He just walks away and dies. That's... That's Dungeon Crawl Stone Super Combat. That's what happens when everything is a dice roll. You know, sometimes it just doesn't work out 55 times in a row. And then you just have to say, well, that's Dungeon Crawl. That's how it is sometimes. Um, alright, let's see. So, I think I really do want to switch over to this vamp body. Just, if, if nothing else, it's because I'm bored. And I want to just try it. I think it's interesting. So I'm going to go ahead and do it. If it sucks, I'm going to die. And that's fine. I'm okay with that. I've accepted my death. I've accepted that I will eventually, at some point, shuffle off this mortal coil. But for now, I'm, in, I'm into that shit. Uh, I'm going to pick up... I'm going to enchant the hat. The reason why I'm going to enchant the hat is because... It has the best chance of staying on my head compared to the other slots. I could arguably maybe consider. Oh, I need int. That's why I need spell casting. Cool. Um, I could consider um, like a cloak of resistance, but unless I get an artifact hat that's really good, I'm probably not going to replace this hat. It's a really good hat. It's like a top tier hat, and uh, of course. Uh, Draconians being as big-headed as they are cannot wear helmets, so, you know, it's always that problem. Okay, cool, this is just gonna happen to me until I die, sure. The Wind Drakes are doing a shitload of damage to me because I'm flying, but at this point I'm so jaded and in pain that I'm just, not, I'm just gonna let them do it to me. Like, I'm just, maybe I deserve it the whole time, you know what I mean? But it's okay, because we have the power of this vampiric weapon, which is really nice. It's actually... Performing quite admirably so far. I haven't really found any reasons to complain about it. Um, hopefully at some point I'll fight something that's like pretty meaningful. And then I'll be able to figure out if this is actually a good weapon or not. I mean it looks like a good weapon. It feels like a good weapon. It's a plus 5 bardish. Ooh, a scroll of requirement. Uh, I think my... Wait, hang on. So the cool thing about this is now you can finally cancel this stupid fucking... Requirements scroll, so you can figure out what the hell you have first before you instantly go into this. We have really top tier loot, but I, I wish I had good gloves. So I guess this is fine. I could also go for jewelry, but I don't know. Well, I got boots of the assassin. That's not actually as good as my boots of running. Well, that's not true actually either, because stabbing is pretty damn strong. Uh, so how it works, I think, with the boots of assassin is uh, it lets you stab with any weapon. I think it stabs as good as a dagger or something. 
so it's pretty good. But this is, I have running, so like running is really good as well. Like running is really good. But I guess I could go stealth. Like that's not horrible, actually. Like if I just train stealth now, like who's gonna stop me, right? It doesn't affect anything, technically. Because, like, now I have stealth. I have no body armor on, and I have no shield on to make me less stealthy, so... I can just kind of stab stuff, I guess. I mean, maybe. And, not only that, stealth is a pretty good way of defending myself in, like, clusterfuck zones like Zot and, and Vaults, because things won't necessarily just immediately, like, gun towards me the second they hear a single penny drop, because that's how this game works. It's like... Oh! One of my friends, my, my, my good mate Frank is shouting from across the fucking floor. Shit, it must be that fucking interloper again. Kill him. Let's get him. I know exactly where he is. I got him down on GPS. They wrote down, the, the shout contained the information for the next, for the coordinates of that character for the next 10 weeks. God damn, this, this communication system we've got going on is really good. I'm surprised that no one's ever stolen it. That, that was, that was, uh, that was the, um... I don't know what that was. Anyway, also, um, I have now got un un uncensored pictures on my phone of Barry the Bee. Now, if you don't know who Barry the Bee is, you guys gotta catch up with your dungeon crawl lore, because Barry the Bee is my editor for these videos. Uh, he was in charge of such excellent films like uh, The Demise Intro and uh, The Demise Outro. So those, those two are like the things that he does. Um, and... You know, I, I got a picture of I was I managed to snap a picture of him. He he moves at sub subsonic speeds, but you know, I was able to I was able to catch him, you know, catch and nap him basically. Uh, when he wasn't paying attention, I took a I took a cheeky photo of him. So, you know, I might I might release that photo one day. Maybe to just Patreon users only, you know what I mean? Just cause you gotta support the cause. Okay. This is gonna be a very bad fight because the door's gonna open at some point. I'm just gonna get shit on. Maybe those are all animals. Maybe they're all animals. They were not animals. That was a lie. I was lying to you the whole time. I apologize. Okay. Well, at the very least, we're doing very good because of this amazing weapon. Apparently, this is a crazy good weapon. Fun fact. Turns out that if you have a really heavy weapon that has vamp on it, you're gonna do well as a character. Who would have thunk? Who would have knew? Not me. Definitely not me. I would have not have known that. That's not the kind of expertise that I have in this game. Despite being a runner. I mean, a speedrunner. Ah, you, ah, you hate to see that. You just hate to see Slay plus 4 on boots. God damn it. I'm gonna have to put that down, and I'm so upset about that. I'm actually so upset. Like, the problem is, I lose 2 AC, which is important for this character. But I also lose like all the benefits of either running or stealth. Like it just it can't compete. It just sucks. But slay plus four is like probably one of the better things. And I also have a really heavy weapon. Slaying is good on any weapon, but it is much better on faster weapons than it is on slow weapons. So it kind of doesn't make sense for me to you know spend all my time with slaying. Not to sorry, not giving up all the slaying stuff. Okay, here we go. Look at this tap, yeah! That was the slowest vamp I've ever seen in my entire life. That was excellent. Oh, here's Ilsu. Um, this is gonna be a good fight, hopefully. Draw her upstairs. I'm actually kind of okay tanking damage because I know that with this weapon I can kind of come back with it. Like right here you can see I'm taking about a quarter of my health, instantly heal back. Very nice. Very nice indeed. See, again, um... People who say that Vamp isn't a good brand, oh my goodness, I just stabbed two guys, I didn't even notice that was what happened. That was awesome, actually. Yeah, so this is what I was kind of hoping for, like, my character is not stealthy much, sort of, but he has, like, stealth. Like, look at that, that's, that's a good amount of stealth, actually. That's one, two, three, four, five, six pips of stealth, that's pretty decent, actually. So, you know, to have that level of stealth on a character that is pretty much a heavy melee is really nice, because... It means that I have the best of both worlds. I can stab for free. Like, I'm using a polearm, so I get even more free stabs from different ranges. Like, damn, dude. This is really lucky. I mean, yeah, you could say that uh, running is better, but... At the same time, it sort of isn't. Running is amazing, don't get me wrong, but... The problem with it, I find, is that a lot of the time... 
the value of it isn't as high when you're just like at the end of the game because most of the time you're surrounded by something which is why you're running away enemies are faster than 10 speed nowadays all the time and you're also in like depths or vaults or something where there's not much space to run around without getting a new pack of enemies somewhere in the unknown it's like running is good um, it definitely can save your ass like a shitload of times it's just that I find that the benefit, while amazing, is not, like, absolute mandatory have to have every single game. Like, there are certain situations where I would say that there are things better. Like, for example, this one, where the stabbing is really good. Uh, I'm gonna feel really sad about this, but I think I have to just heroism finesse here. Just throw some piety out, you know what I mean? Just, just spend some piety, gotta make that cheddar. Kill these guys real quick. Just chop them up. And again, the vamp weapon is just incredible for this exact reason. It just slaughters everything instantly, and I don't have to do any any hard work at all. And I, have to, I didn't even have to think for that fucking bolt fight. That was crazy. Truly, vampiric, like, people who use vampiric weapons, truly patrician taste, you know what I mean? Anyone who says vamp is bad, pleb. Pleb too. But I, I don't think anyone's really saying vamp is bad. Except that one guy, but I don't know where he went. Oh, that's not good. That's okay. I have eight blink scrolls. I'll, I'll let you have that one, Mr. Kraken Man. Just kidding. I'm vengeful. I'm a vengeful god. I will fight back. How dare you attack me and my lovely... Uh, oh god, you're really doing that to me, aren't you? You dead? Yeah, you dead. Nice. Alright. Uh, it's been 30 minutes. I'm going to leave it here because I need to go back to sleep. So thanks for watching, everyone. Hope you all enjoyed, and I'll see you all tomorrow.